but yeah, definitely look for it and, uh, if you're planning a trip. Uh, so we did. We made it as far as uh, Fort Erie. We spent the night. It was great. Uh, we were getting up the next morning, which I believe was a Sunday morning. I can't remember if Halloween was on a Friday. I think the Halloween was a Friday this past year. Yes, it was. Uh, so it was no, 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 no. It was a sa it was a Saturday that we left that we left there because left there. Yeah. Oh, okay. that we left Fort Erie to cross the border. Okay. Oh, right. Because we had to wait before we could go. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, so yeah, we went down. We spent the night. It was it was excellent. Uh, we got up the next morning early, and we headed for the border. Just jacked. <laughs> yeah. Just ready totally to go. Jacked. Uh, we uh we arrived at the border wasn't too crazy for for weights or anything we were excited uh going across the peace bridge was fun though oh yeah yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah i'm not a big bridge guy <laughs> <laughs> so uh so we get to the front i'm first uh i roll up to the booth uh take my helmet off shut the bike off proper protocols hand the guy my uh uh, my passport, yep. he asked, asked me a couple very simple questions. Where are you going tonight? Which our first stop was going to be Pennsylvania. Yep. Uh, and was my motorcycle registered in Ontario? <laughs> Two simple questions. Yep. Handed me back my paperwork. Uh, <laughs> off I went through. I actually asked if uh, there was a spot that I could pull off so that I could wait for Adam. Uh, so they guided me to an area and I went over there and waited. <laughs> and I pulled up, <laughs> and uh, I was not greeted with that question. I was greeted with a series of of uh, sort of even before I handed over my passport. It was where are you going, Pennsylvania? What are you doing? I'm going on this trip. Why? And <laughs> and and when asked why, I said for the adventure. And he says, what do you mean? And I just, I just stared at him like, what do I mean? I mean, yeah. I'm going on the adventure, right? Yeah, I'm, yeah. And, and, and he was just, he was not accepting any of that. <laughs> and, and I had had to do some background paperwork because of, uh, because of a, a legal issue that I had had in Canada and, uh, and thought that we had all of that in order. Yep, we were apparently so, misinformed. Yeah, and so he says, uh, he says, you know, you're gonna have to pull over there and go go in that building, and suddenly my stung, stomach sank. Yeah. And uh, and sure enough, the paperwork wasn't wasn't what we needed. <laughs> nope. And we sat there for a few hours. Oh, at least three. Yeah. Right. Uh, and and uh, yeah, just and just miserable. Yeah. And I remember because <clears throat> Adam had been inside for probably an hour, oh, maybe yeah. an hour and 15 minutes uh, when a border guard came out to get me and uh, brought me inside or asked me to come inside because you were not allowed to come out to me. Yeah. So when I got inside, Adam was just beside oh, himself. Devastated. He was devastated in head in his hands. Uh, like the first thing I said to you was, I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, yeah, it was. And, and and my response was, you know what? We we knew this was a possibility, right? Yeah. They don't have to let us in, and and yeah. So we uh, we sat there. We we kind of tried every angle at the border, and and can we do this? Can we expedite this? And yeah. and they basically told us, no. There's nothing you can do yeah. from here. Yeah. Uh, so with that, we turned around uh, back to Fort back Erie to Fort into Erie. a motel for the night. After we hit an LCBO, <laughs> right? Yes, yes. We, we did pick up some alcohol, uh, and then and then the phones. We oh. were just working the phones and social media, and, yeah. and what can How we do? Can we... How can we fly our bikes? Where can we do, do yeah. this? Do who this? Who can do ship that? it by truck? And yeah. Who can this? And like Adam was prepared to fly over the U.S. to get to Mexico and meet me and yeah. the motorcycles there. Oh, there were all kinds uh, of things. Again, had there been no budget restraints. It probably would have happened, absolutely. right? Absolutely, and it would have been a horrible mistake. Uh, absolutely, uh, right? So, uh, because it, it wasn't feasible. Everything we looked at was not feasible no. to, uh, and, and it changed the trip so much. It did. And, it and, did. And there like was so it, many things. It eliminated so many kilometers, so many stops, so many things that we wanted to see, yeah. and, and people that we wanted to meet up with, and and everything else. So, so, and and I'll put there. We have a whole video series explaining all of that. I'll put links to that. Yeah. Um, but uh, 
but but then you know and, and the whole adventure of going to embassies and, oh, and all yeah. of that stuff yeah um end of the day we came back to london yeah <laughs> yeah and <laughs> with our tails between our legs <laughs> and just just miserable i mean i'd given up my apartment mm-hmm. we had sold our vehicles and um and and so just started to rebuild life rick went back to work i went and found another job <laughs> um well, you proved that was easy, so. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I seem to be. I seem to be good at finding gigs. Um, and and then and then we've spent you know the last the last few months, um, or we we spent we spent about a month and a half saying we can leave. In March. In March. Or late February. Late February, early March. Early, early March. Which was, we were going to truck the bikes down to, when the paperwork was in order, we yeah. were going to truck the bikes to, to St. Tennessee. Tennessee, where yeah. it was warm, start the trip from there, and and carry on planning to be back here again July, June, July of, of this year. Yeah. Um, and that became not a reality as yeah. well. Uh, we looked at. Uh, I, I, think, I think we both just looked at each other one day and went, "It changes it too much." Yeah, it's not. It's yeah. not the trip that we wanted. Right. We're we're rushing at that point. We're we're fighting against weather. Sorry, we weren't aiming to be back in July. No, we were going to extend it and try and be back here by October. Yeah, uh, which meant. Uh, down south through the summer, uh, Arizona and Nevada in like August in 130 degree temperatures. Eastern Canada, uh, Eastern in Eastern Canada in September, yeah. where they're already temperatures are already plummeting. It just, like you said, it wasn't going to be the trip that we we planned or wanted. Yeah. Uh, so with that, we said October. Yep. Yeah, we'll we'll push the trip an entire year. We'll take off two weeks earlier than we were going to. Uh, this past year and leave the beginning of October instead of October 15th. Yep. And here we are. Yep. <laughs> COVID-19. COVID-19. 